Hey, Math Maniacs! Today, for our Warm Up Wednesday, we're going to be sharing an activity that we think you're probably already quite familiar with. Um, it is called Which One Doesn't Belong? And I'm not sure who the original creator was. The person that I always give credit to is the Canadian high school teacher. Her name is Mary Barassa. Uh, and she started the Which One Doesn't Belong.ca or WODB.ca. Uh, as well as she has a fabulous uh, WODB math on Twitter you can follow along with. You're going to see the slideshow will be available for you if you would like to download and use in your classroom. All I've done is gone through pulling the images from their Twitter, from the website, and just kind of done one image per page. We find that that works best for our students, so they're only focusing on one image at a time. Uh, and to demonstrate how you yeah, my do friend, this. we've got Desmond. Hi. We've got Kyla and Sienna. Hello. All familiar faces for you here at Math Mania if you've so been following us for a while. Most about this activity is that there's more than one correct answer and in fact we challenge our students to see if they can come up with a reason for why each photo or each object doesn't belong. We love to hear the discussion and the debate and everything that happens and to hear their thinking and their reasons while we're doing this activity. So we're going to start, we're going to do an example showing you photos, an example showing you shapes, an example showing you with numbers. And like I said, this slideshow will be available for free download. Uh, we cannot take credit for any of the images. I have tried to cite all of them from where I took them from, whether it was the website or the Twitter account, um, just to give people who took the photos full credit. Another thing you can do as well, which will be up soon as well, is you can also, once you do this with your class for a little while, you can help them start to create their very own which one doesn't belong by finding photos on the internet. And we will have a little slideshow to share with you about how they can do that so you can start using their examples in class because they absolutely love it. Right. So as you can see, there's a big image um, and there are, we always kind of number them. So first object, second, third, fourth. And we just ask a question, which one doesn't belong or which object or which donut does not belong? All right, so here's the photos. All right, now we're gonna go to our friends. Desmond, which donut doesn't belong and why? The third one, because it's the only one with nuts. Okay, thank you. Oh Kyla, which one doesn't belong and why? Um, the first one, because it's the only one without icing. Okay, thank you. Sienna, which one doesn't belong and why? The second one, because it's the only one that doesn't have a hole in it. Okay, thank you. And uh, here is a fabulous educational assistant that works in our classroom. This is Donna Davidson making her Math Mania debut. Donna, which one doesn't belong and why? Number four. Why? Because it's pink. The others have chocolate. Okay, thank you. Round. All right, okay, okay, round two. This time we'll go in reverse order. We'll invite Donna up first. Okay. Donna, which one doesn't belong and why? This one because it doesn't have any points like the others. Okay, thank you. Sienna, which one doesn't belong and why? That one because it has a line separating um, the shape. Oh, yeah, because it's made from two shapes, right? A rectangle and a triangle, thank you. Kyla, which one doesn't belong and why? Um, this one because it's the only one that doesn't have a red right outline. Thank you. And here's Ashley. Ashley, which one doesn't belong and why? Uh, this one right here because it's the only one that's not filled in with the color. Example yeah. of the number one. Desmond, can you please come up and tell us which number doesn't belong and why? 16 because it's the only one with a one. Thank you. Which one doesn't belong and why? Nine because it's the only one um, with only one digit. Thank you. Sienna, which one doesn't belong and why? 16 because it's the only even number. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Ashley, which one doesn't belong and why? Uh, the nine, because when I add up the two digits and add the sum of them, it is seven. And this one obviously is on its own. It doesn't equal seven. Donna, which okay. one doesn't belong and why? 43. Why? Because this one is not divisible by any number. This is divisible by five. This is divisible by many numbers. This is divisible by three. Wow, thank you. So as you can see, there's a whole range of answers you can do. Um, and yeah, it's a really great open-ended 
mini math warm up. We hope that you enjoy. You try it with your students. We will have this slideshow available for free download on our Teachers Pay Teachers store within the next 24 hours of posting this video.